What's going on my fellow gamers? It's T Reaper and I'm back with another video. <coughs> a shout out to all my Twitter fans. Yo, shout out to all the uh, people in this Twitter feed that is being mentioned. I'm going to have fun with this because this is funny. Um, anyway, so I have been having a blast on Wrecking Zone on Crackdown 3. Shout out to Microsoft. And also, I think this is really funny how no one knows how to get good at this game. Uh, and I say this because I keep going into shutout matches. Uh, and it's actually uh, kind of simple. Does anybody know what noob combos are? Uh, I dearly hope to God at least some of you do. Uh, you know, at least the old people, please like this video if you at least know what noob, com no noob combos are. Uh, so, like, in my day it was the big ones, sniper and shotgun, um, you also, uh, oh uh, yeah, rocket launcher and sniper, uh, uh, pistol and shotgun are my favorite combo, um, and, uh, basically, basically the essential concept of a noob combo for all newcomers who don't know what that is is it's basically an essential fast easy way to get the hit markers necessary to take down the HP of the opposing opponent fastly quickly hit. so it's basically a faster way to kill people to make it easier but uh, because Crackdown 3 Wrecking Zone is designed in such a way that a lot of new people have never played this type of game before. Uh, I'm going to tell you where this kind of comes from. Um, I think this kind of comes from a little bit of Unreal Tournament. Uh, a little bit. And it also feels like a Crackdown game. Just pointing that out there. But, you know, the multiplayer is fun because it in involves the concept of noob combos. Which makes the achievements on this game kind of difficult in one scenario. And I'm only going to say one for now because I'm only working on one difficult one. Uh, I have almost all the others. So, the one requires you to get a kill with every single gun in every single match. Um, the trick is, is, you have to be a fit. This is where the skill comes in, people. Please listen. Uh, this is why you have to be efficient with every single gun before you attempt that achievement. Otherwise, you always get down to the last weapon that you're about to choose, or uh, almost halfway through for those who are not fast enough. Uh, I keep getting it to the very freaking end of my combo list, and the match keeps ending. Oh, uh, which is really annoying. But that's the only reason I can't gain the achievement is because the match don't the matches don't extend long. Um, so what I have to learn is how to be faster than trick. Yeah. Uh, and the get wrecking zone is actually really, really fast. Uh, I'll give it this, like, played correctly in the right lobby, this is kind of a good fast pace between um, your wonderful Call of Duty and your wonderful BR. Uh, and I'm gonna say it's like in the moderate range between the two people. And I'm talking about legit BR and legit like legit Call of Duty. So like the fastest Call of Duty versus you know the fastest you know BR sequence that you go through. You know gameplay wise. And I'm not talking length, I'm talking like like gameplay wise how fast it is. How fast it is you are required to know what you are doing. So you have to be fast on those buttons and fast on those triggers and have to know how to use every single one of those weapons. So getting back to noob tubes. Noob tubes I found was funny because it took me a while, a while to realize that's what they were. Uh, I kept realizing that I couldn't kill everybody with every single gun, so I was like, you know what, I'll switch. But really what that is, is that's really a noob combo. It just depends which one is efficient enough to be called a noob combo, so then you have to test every combo. And what I found is I love the Annihilator and I love my pistol. Um, developers, if you're listening to this, like, that's kind of the noob combo that I would say you need to nerf. You need to nerf the wonderful handgun pistol and not so much the annihilator because that just does just fine. Yeah, you can't kill it. You can't kill somebody with a single shot, well, single clip of that. You have to keep using a noob combo. But again, that might be the challenge within the game itself, 
when you know requires you to know how to use both weapons at the same time bada bing bada boom makes you faster makes you evolve makes you be quick on that trigger uh but i found it funny because no one understood how to get good at it i kept coming into lobbies that everybody like legitly didn't know what they were doing so it was kind of funny and i kept going into shutout matches it was hilarious uh but like it was like i'm like have you ever heard of the new combo and i was just going around just killing everybody and it was kind of and it was basically kind of funny but like you know no one ever heard of new combo that's kind of a key wrecking zone please learn your new combo and you will be victorious also please learn how to kill people faster it took three people to kill me i'm not joking uh this is reaper this is just a quick video please hit that like button button like comment subscribe if you don't know i'm on xbox live almost all the time i am on Instagram pretty much all the time and Twitter all the time and of course my Facebook all the time so I am always around on every platform I just come in different forms so I hope you guys all enjoy this video I hope you guys all have a good day and this is Rupert and I'm out